Legal as part have taxed the federal government, including the legislative arm of government, to learn its lessons from the recent Supreme Court ruling on the convicted former governor of Abia State, Senator Aji Uzokalu. They say the upturn of the conviction of the former governor by the nation's apex court is proof that the three arms of government do not collaborate during the process of lawmaking, which leaves holes in the nation's laws capable of frustrating the fight against corruption. They want the three arms of government to form a common front, synergize and patronize as parts, a situation that would be a win-win for the nation. Any time, any bill, any law, any policy of government, you know, is proposed, the lawmakers may well take a consultant from the judicial arm. If they do that, there's a possibility that such consultant will bring a judicial view to the proposed legal, you know, law. It is possible, but even at that, but the, the best thing we have learned is that it is always good to consult in extenso before we make our laws. Some of these government agencies uh, who are in charge of ensuring and advancing and fighting crime and corruption in our country, so many times play to the gallery because they need to impress people in position of authority. And that is very, very wrong. So when you do your job, do your job diligently and ensure that everything is properly done. Now it is lack of diligence that has brought us to this level we are today.